So production target? Yeah, we still maintain the production level of 550 million tons for the year. And uh, the stripping ratio has slightly increased. And if you, see, if you notice the growth in the overburden, this year has been comparatively more. And uh, in fact, if the absolute figure shows that there is almost 34% growth in the overburden removal this year. Okay, fair enough, sir. But to get to the targeted 550 million tons, we will have to see a run rate of 48 to 50 million tons per month. From which month will this be likely? That will be, that will be after the monsoons only and maybe from December onwards and so on. Okay, and what's your sense about uh, railway rake availability? In August, uh, actually, in fact, we have loaded around 212, uh, this rake requirement loading plan was around 218. Against that, we loaded around 195 rakes. And if you compare with the previous figure of uh, August 14, it was 178. So there was a growth of almost, you can say, 16, 17, 16 to 17 rakes over the last year. And uh, this is the target of around 218 rakes, which we had planned during the monsoon. Okay, what is the premium on e-auction sales currently? It's around 36 to 40 percent, somewhere varying between that. Okay, the, the, the ministry has recommended on the need to rationalize uh, uh, Coal India's contract prices based on calorific value. Could this translate into 3.6 percent hike in lower grade coal prices, but also lead to a 10 percent cut in higher grade prices? Uh, I don't think it will be proper for me to comment at this point of time because the pricing is one part where the board takes a call and taking all the pros and cons, examining all the aspects. So when the right time comes, certainly board will take a call on that. All right. What about the potential price increases on FSA? So uh, I don't know whether let the board take a call on when the correction is to be done, what is to be done. But uh, certainly there is a scope for the with respect to international prices. There is a in the lower band there is a discount of 35 to 40 percent. Okay, fair enough, sir. And last quick question then. Diesel prices have come down in this quarter. What's the outlook on margin expansion? Uh, it should certainly, but then the diesel prices keep on varying and they keep on changing very frequently. So I don't think it will be possible for me to preempt at this point of time. Okay, fair enough, sir. So we leave it on that note. Thank you very much for joining in and talking to us. So that's the outlook coming in on Coal India, where August was definitely better than July, which was uh, uh, touted as an aberration by the management, and they stick to their FY16 guidance in terms of total production as well. But let's shift.